hey y'all welcome back to my channel so today i'm gonna be doing a get ready with me if you are interested on how i achieve this makeup look this hair the perfume the outfit please stay tuned thank you hey y'all so today we're gonna be talking about how to detach from someone oh it's too much but we're gonna be talking about how to detach from someone emotionally now for those of you who's following up with my videos you guys know I just came out of a relationship and honestly and truly like first going off it's been really hard but it's getting better so these are some of the steps that I am taking first of all ladies guys just focus on yourself take the time out to figure out like who you are as a person and what you like what you dislike like enjoy your own company okay so yeah the first step is to put yourself first like focus on you like focus on you create new goals find new hobbies think about things that makes you happy like figure out if you like skydiving if you like swimming like a lot of times like when we relationships we just get so caught up on trying to please the your partner we forget like hey we have to have a life too so while you are away from that person and you're single you want to take the time out and figure out like who you are as a person you know that's the first step second step always stay busy you are my eyes my eyes been getting really irritated for the past couple of days for some reason I don't know I've been waking up with like gunks and gunks of coal in my eye and I don't know why but you all see like the little puffiness my eyes aren't naturally like that I don't know if I need to go back to the eye doctor but maybe I do but yeah focus on yourself read books work out like I've been working out a lot I've been reading a lot I just been taking out the time for myself like you know and if that person decides to call you like don't answer and if you have to go to that extent to block that person or delete them then do what's necessary because at the end of the day you want to make sure like you happy you healthy this, this is all about you especially if you have no intentions on going back to that relationship like do what's necessary to protect your peace you know I'm not going into details as to exactly what I do and so y'all just have to pay attention because this really this video is basically a get ready with me but well, it's a chit chat you know so and then a lot of times like say for example you was in a relationship with that person that person used to buy you like so much things you know so every time you touch something or you look at something hey this thing reminds me of that person so Go and replace those things. Like, I'm not saying throw them away, but you can give them to somebody if it's that deep, you know. For me, at first, I I was experiencing that in a sense. 
So what I did was I gave a whole lot of stuff for my mom. It's a whole lot of stuff like jewelry, perfume. So even if I get them, I'm even if I still want them, like when I 100% over that person, I'll just go right back to my mom and get them. So just seeing them might cost me call them or whatever. So that's what to do. Okay, so now I'm going in my satin powder. Yeah, so y'all, I'm going to get myself on a date. Really feeling sushi. So, that's what I'm getting ready for. I think I'm going to wear my orange little orange two-piece set. I'm not sure, but I'm thinking about it. I'm thinking about it. I just want my makeup to look really detailed today. So I'm going in with this Ruby Kisses powder, and this is in color number 12 caramel so now I'm going in and I'm gonna snatch my nose okay Okay, so the main important thing is basically mastering the art of enjoying your own company. That's the main important thing. Like, I feel like how I started doing things on my own and not depending on anybody else for my happiness or to even make me smile or whatever. I think that is so powerful like I gained so much power over this period you know I can look in the mirror and tell myself I look good you know I really don't have to wait on somebody to tell me that so it's just basically loving yourself at the end of the day finding peace and happiness within yourself not depending depending on anybody else the happiness i'm going to and a lot of people is like go and rush and get into other relationships so quickly whereas you don't even know if you're prepared to deal with somebody else with another personality and figure out this person traits characteristics like I mean, I don't know how serious y'all is take relationships, but me, I take relationships serious because that's just how I am. Like, whatever, whenever I put my time and my interest and my effort into something, I try to give the best. I like, put my best foot forward. Yeah. But y'all understand what I'm saying, I think. I hope I need some blush on my nose. My eyes look so freaking puffy. I look like I catch no sleep. Wow. My face looks good though. Oh my god, my eyes look so puffy. <sighs> uh, I'm thinking about putting on mascara, but maybe I won't. I don't know. I just want a clean under eye. 
and then I don't want anything to make my what's going on what's going on here I don't want anything to make my my eyes look even worse because some my eyes is irritated like I don't know why but you know what Okay, I look better. Okay, now that makes sense. Nobody's gonna know. Nobody's gonna know. Yes, they will know. <laughs> My lips are so freaking dry, and this one is so big. What the hell? When I get my teeth done? When I get my take done, nobody can talk to me. Nobody can talk to me, my dear. Maybe like this. Y'all see how my teeth kick out? The top kick out? <laughs> like, I really didn't want braces because... Uh, they look like they like really hard to clean and like when I see people with braces they have all type of grits and thing up in their braces like ah eh, why 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 so it turned me off honestly so I'ma just get me some veneers and call it a day period and they said braces hurt too so I'ma get me some veneers Okay, so I have on this orange two-piece set, and I'm going to wear this with gold accessories, gold jewelry. I have these heart studs. Yo, my face looks so puffy today. Oh my god. And the thing is, I have been eating a whole bunch of fruits lately, so I'm not putting on any weight. I don't know why. Why is my face looking so fat? Or maybe it's this hairstyle. Then I'm going in with this. Oh, let me come back. Oh. So y'all can see me. So now I'm going in with this hard chin. I don't know how this combination is going to come out because I made it up in my head. But let's see. Let's see if it's giving. Now I have this chunky, chunky chin. And I want that like real tight. And I have this other chin would actually have like a lock. So let's see. Maybe, maybe not. Maybe it's a run out. It's definitely a freaking run out. <laughs> ah! I know. Dying to work, y'all. Dying to work. Dying to work. Anyway, that's a no. And now I'm going in with my gold Michael Cross watch. My favorite. And then this heart bead chain. I had this so long and then this gold bracelet on this hand yeah and now oh, these clothes I just took off now I'm going in with this clear gold bag clear and gold bag and then these clear shoes so that's a look I just hope to get some cute pictures y'all my nails I just took my nails off earlier and obviously I don't have time to get them done so this is what's up this is the look for today I can't put on any rings today because my nails aren't done so yeah so this is a two-piece set as y'all can see the shirt is like this and then the skirt is picture and that's the end of this video bye